up, y'all? It's your boy, AJ, and this is AJ Reacts 2. And today, we got a Blu-ray haul. Every month, I gotta come back and do it. I know I'm on hiatus, but, you know, we gotta do it every month. So, this month is gonna be a little different. I got some Funkos, and I picked up some video games, so... Uh, we just gonna get into it. So first up, Dragon Ball Fighters PS4. I already had it for the Nintendo Switch, um, but I kind of wanted to, you know, see how the gameplay was on PS4. So this is like probably the best Dragon Ball Z game that I've ever played, um, and I played pretty much all of them. So next up is a steel book, Whiplash, bruh. The blood on the symbol right there, Whiplash, bro. Like this is. Like, one of my favorite, all-time favorite movies. I watched it recently. Loved it. Um, it has some coarse language in it. So, just, you know, heads up there if you're offended by that type of thing. But this is, like, one of the best movies I've ever seen in my life. So well put together. The score was just phenomenal. Acting, like, out of this world, like, mind-blowing, bro. So, if you haven't seen Whiplash, definitely check it out. Next up is a ps4 game doom man i've been playing this and it's been super super fun yeah so i've been playing this it's kind of like a it's just definitely a shooter game kind of like halo a little bit um so yeah it's been awesome to play it's really fun um this is one film that i have not seen i got it on blu-ray it was at Walmart at one of those like $5 bins and I know it's a classic musical. I'm a huge musical fan. West Side Story. I know that they're making a new one and I'm I'm excited. Next up is another video game, but um it is actually a still book and it's really hard for me to find video games and still books together. Two of my favorite things and it's just so hard to find sometimes and it's Mortal Kombat 11 and um this is the slip cover. Pull that baby. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh, bro. That's so clean. So yeah, I mean, Mortal Kombat is Mortal Kombat. I mean, you guys know that that game is lit. So next up is Resident Evil, the final chapter. Um, I heard that this was one of the suckiest uh, Resident Evils and... I haven't seen it. This is the only Resident Evil film that I haven't seen, so I went ahead and picked it up. It was in the $5 bin as well. I haven't heard anything about this film. I haven't uh, seen a trailer. I I think I've heard of it like once before, but I'm, I don't know anything about it. Uh, Brad Pitt, Killing Them Softly. Um, and the still book is sweet. Look at that. So nice. So I'm gonna check this movie out. I don't know if it's good or not. I have no clue. So I'm gonna check it out. And a, a lot of you guys may know uh, that I have not seen a Matthew McConaughey film, but I went ahead and picked one up, uh, Mud. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna start with this one. I'll probably start with Interstellar, um, but then I'll probably check this one out. Uh, I've been wanting to see this movie for a while. Then I got Straight Outta Compton, The Steel Book. It's pretty cool. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Then I finished my Dark Knight Trilogy Steelbook collection. Uh, picked up the Dark Knight. I told y'all I was going to get it. The Joker, Heath Ledger's Joker. It's probably my favorite of the trilogy. I don't know, though. Batman Begins is like a close second. Sometimes they alternate between my favorites. And then my buddy Trevor referred me to this film, Troy. I went ahead and picked it up. I did a reaction to one of the um, battle scenes on the film. So if you haven't seen that, uh, go check that out. But I picked up Troy. So uh, I heard it's pretty good. I'm going to check it out. One of my, I think this probably is my all-time favorite war film and i'm not a war film guy at all i'm not a big fan of war films um but this one hacksaw ridge i picked up on steelbook i watched it a few weeks ago and i absolutely loved it i love the storytelling my buddy chris says saving private ryan is the best war film or his favorite war film he'll probably have my head for saying hacksaw ridge is the best but 
I'm sorry, buddy. Hacksaw Ridge is the best war film, in my opinion, in my opinion, because I'm not that big on war films. But Saving Private Ryan, I have my own thoughts about that. I might do a review. But yeah, another still book that I picked up, still got the tag on it, uh, Safe House, Denzel Washington, uh, Ryan Reynolds. Uh, I've seen this movie a long time ago. I remember it being pretty good, so I'm gonna uh, watch it, rewatch it, check it out again. And last but not least, certainly not least, picked up a video game, Last of Us Part Two. I more than likely will come out with a complete spoiler-filled review for this film when I come back from hiatus, or this move, this game. Uh, when I come back from hiatus, I really, really enjoyed this game. A lot of people hated on it. Some sequences of events happened on this game that were questionable. And I, you know, plan on discussing that. So, Last of Us Part 2. Don't get spoiled. If you haven't played the game, if you haven't, you know, gone through watch to walkthroughs or whatever, do not spoil the game for yourself. Don't listen to uh critics and stuff like that experience the game for yourself and then have your opinions it is a great game uh the first one masterpiece not better than the first one i'll say that not better than the first one but it is a masterpiece so that will do it for my video games and still books slash movies blu-rays or whatever uh, i have two funkos so starting with my first one i got lucas from stranger things so that's pretty dope. One of my favorite characters from Stranger Things. And last but not least, I got Lando Calrissian from Star Wars. And it doesn't say, it just says Star Wars there. I don't know if this is from the Solo film, but it does kind of have Donald Glover's likeness. So I... I don't know. You tell me if this is from either Empire or Solo. So that's going to do it for my Blu-ray haul this month. I am returning with videos on the reg August 5th. Come check me out. Mark your calendars. Um, I have another video that's going to drop July 15th. So that's going to be the last hiatus video until I come back full force with season five. Thank you guys for all the support and um, thank you just for checking me out. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching and I will catch you guys next time.